if we asked you how much is 2 plus 2, quite effortlessly you would say 4. Although physicists might say mostly 4, an economist would shut the door, close the windows and in a hushed whisper ask, how much do you want me to make it? But what if we asked you how much is 17 times 47? Well, you could solve it but with some effort and in doing so, your muscles will tense, your pupils will dilate and your heart rate will increase. You may not become aware of these subtle physiological changes but they happen whenever you think hard. There are two very distinct ways your brain solves problems. Not physically but metaphorically, you can think of your brain having two dimensions. System 1 which thinks fast, effortlessly and automatically and System 2 which thinks slowly and deliberately. System 1 is at work when you see an angry face. You don't have to think too hard to figure out that a person is angry. Or if you see a photograph of your loved one, the instinctive reaction you have, affection or caring, is all instantly processed in System 1. System 2 performs two types of operations, complex computations and self-control, that is the inhibition of impulses. And when System 2 is on, you focus on the task at hand and your attention is fully devoted to it. These two systems guide your perception. We've seen in previous modules how System 1's automated responses are usually very useful in day-to-day -day thinking but they can also fool you. Recall the optical and the auditory illusions and the cognitive biases we discussed. And this can lead to erroneous perception and hence wrong decisions. Also, how you perceive the world determines how you interpret it and you behave accordingly. Going on a slight tangent, Shiva's third eye, which when open destroys everything, could metaphorically be considered as the eye that when opened looks inward and destroys the way you have been perceiving the world so far. World is Maya or illusion in the sense that it is based on how the observer perceives it. Two people viewing the same situation may interpret it very differently.